Oh, you want to go touch the shark? It's not just for these kiddos, it's also for the adults as well. It just goes for everyone. What we are touching, now the only spot that we should touch is going to be right on the top of the back. We want to avoid anywhere on the eyes, face, or tails, just because as we know a lot of animals are not too fond of being touched in those areas. And you guessed it, especially sharks and rays. So right on the top of the back with two fingers, again, that goes for the adults as well as the kids. We also want to keep in mind, friends, that this is Sea turtle. That live? Yeah. There's sharks too. The reef shark. You see the the white on his nose? That's from hitting the the thing too much. Lost? Yeah. Not happy. Oh, that big fish. Yep. Black, there's a black tip. And then there's the big fat one too. Yeah. What are these guys? It's a type of fish. Bass. Queensland grouper. <laughs> He's having fun. Hey, that's big thing. Oh, there's your Oscar. <laughs> Look at this one upside down. <laughs> That's uh, me. Oh, look, it's coming right to you. Oh, there you go. That's a black tip. They said that's the new exhibit. Black look, tips have been known to, to take bites out of people. Yeah. Well, look, you can barely see this. You see the silhouette of him. Is there only one shark in there? No, there's a couple. Oh, look at him. That fish swarm reminds you from the Yeah, look, look at him. He's coming there up. There he is. You eat good. Is he going back? Dude. It's dude crush. He's old as shit. Uh, the, the little black tip here. Here he comes. Look at this. Hun. That's not all over his body. He's been banging the glass. He don't like it. No. Come on.
That's a baby black tip right there. Those sharks won't go after the turtles. What about the fish? No, they're fed. I'm just sitting there like, yeah? what are you looking at? Sharks don't look happy though. Do they? That's a baby, isn't it? Yeah, it's a baby. Look, here comes one right here. Hammerhead, D'Angelis. D'Angelis, a hammerhead. D'Angelis, your favorite shark. He's swimming away. He just came up to the window. He came right up to the window. I was trying to call you. Big hammerhead too, you missed it. coming right to you. That's a baby. Yeah. Do they see us? I think so. Alright. Oh, you want to go touch the starfish? Come on. Right from the start to finish, uh, one of these guys molting the player on our social media. Oh, they're like, the smallest thing ever seen. Look at these guys. So, and again, like, if you guys really want to look it up, I would just Google it. These are salt. Instead of trying to, like, salt water, yeah. social media, because it's been so many posts down. They're the pink well one. So over there. He's gonna, down right there. Right there, look. He's going to come right here. Look at this pretty He's one. Pretty. He's pretty. He's pretty. Yeah. So, again, guys, if you're just joining us here, again, remember that every animal you're going to be touching today in our touch areas are boneless animals. So you guys want to be as gentle with them as possible. For our horse crabs, just gently touch them on the top of their body. Oh, he's pretty. Yeah. Avoiding their tails. If you could reach the sea stars and urchin, just you can touch them. But right in the center, right in front of me, where the gray rocks are, is their break room. So we're not allowed to touch anything right here. All of the Ooh, other two rock formations, yes, you can touch them. Yeah, yeah. he's rare. It's not the touch zone if you want to only touch these stars. You want to go down to the creature, creature just down the hall. That's going to be a lot easier than sure they don't eat them? There. No, they don't. The no, they're, they're very rare. rare. Just the sea stars and that are a bit of a pain here. They like where it's nice and dark and shaded. And with those rock conditions, you will see that. They do have eyes. Sea stars have an eye at the end of each arm that can see just shadows. So they will go to wherever it's darkest until like nighttime, and that's when they start getting very Baby. Look at this guy. I don't know. He's got a weird looking face, too. He's got a big nose. He's eating off him. Look. He's cleaning off. Cleaning him. Guys, what's that? He's a giant lobster. Uh, 
fish? Seahorses. Well, that this thing floating right here is a fish. Is it? Yeah. It's a <clears throat> pipe fish. Is it dead? No. You see the tails? There's more pipe fish back Where's there. Where's the seahorse in that? I don't know. And again, if you guys do have any questions at all about anything going on in the aquarium today, Oh, here's some seahorses. They're oh, chilling. Yeah, they're, they're chilling. And oh, those are them? Yeah. Different programs that come out that are going to do our first daughter show downstairs in the theater. She's still with me. I don't know, I'm probably in there. Yeah. Oh, there's Jade. Straight ahead. What you got here? Starfish. I like starfish, but. Yeah. What are we looking at? I see monkeys and parrots. Yep. I, I don't think monkeys will be in a non enclosed cage. But I think that's like a tent. Because you can hear them. Or just sound effects. Man, there's something over there. Yeah. Hang on. Yeah, that's a vent. <laughs> That's an elevator. That's an elevator there. So we go back down? Yeah, I'm thinking so. Oh, it's lightning and storming now. Yeah, I think they're doing a little show. Yeah. That's what they are. 
You put your hand in there and a little bit of blood, they'll rip it off. Really? Because we're in the Amazon rainforest. Monkey like this? There's no monkey in there. You said there were. There's nowhere to contain them. The monkey would get out. I thought you jumped from there. What's going on there? Yeah, these are all piranha. That, that's piranha. That's a piranha? Those are all piranha. No, they wouldn't have it that low where you can just put your hand in. That's piranha, Jade. It says, don't put your hand in. It says, though, yeah. It says, don't put your hand on. It says, do not stand. This is not a step. We're going from the Amazon rainforest to the Arctic? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Jay, there's no monkeys in there. They get out. Yeah, they, there's but no. But if you look, the, the green thing, I think it has a sensor. No, is there's it? nothing there. What the hell is that? Uh, it's a bird. So how how they have a little thing here? That's there's a fence, mesh fence there. Yes, there is. Jay, it's a mesh it. fence. You can see it. See it? It's a mesh fence. Wow, he's weird. Yeah, but there he is. A kookaburro. See it, Jay? That's probably what's on the monkey. He's got a snake in there with him. What? Look at the snake skin. There's a snake somewhere in here. Not necessarily. Yeah, maybe. I don't think there's a snake in there with him. I don't know, there's snake skin on the ground too. Oh, there's penguins. Yeah, they are. Where's your mom? Oh, your mom's still back with Cuckoo Burrow. <laughs> yeah. Little penguins. Right here, straight ahead. Saw that. That was like four. Oh shit, did he? <laughs> or did he? Yeah, he did. Huh? Yeah, 
Yeah. Wow, look at that big guy. Big old fish. You're supposed to be like in a sunken ship. Oh, they can go up to light. Yeah. Look at how big that puffer fish is in the back. What, he puffs up? Yeah, he puffs up. Yeah. Trumpet fish. What is that? Trumpet fish, it says. That's a fish? Yeah. Skinny fish. Oh, here we go. That's all them in there? Yeah. There's another big puffer fish. Looks like smaller. Yeah. Sorry. I don't know. Oh, eels. <laughs> what are those things? Are those alive? Yeah. They are Cassiopeia. It's a type of jellyfish. I'm not going to have that in my tank. Salt water, dear. Is it? Yeah. There's a lobster over here. He's not blue. No. Yeah. There's a lobster there too. I bet he pinch you. Surprised they don't eat the fish. Yeah. Hey, it's huge. Yeah. He's trying to pinch me. <laughs> <laughs> The lionfish. Yeah, and venomous. She was on it. See the needles on his top? Very venomous. Really? Yep. Oh, look at that big boy. Yep. 
So they could kill you? Yeah. Somebody's underwater. second diver is for. You see what's in his hand? He's got it protected. It's a shark stick, so if the shark gets too close, it's his job to watch the other guy's back. Yes, right up here. Sharks in there? Yeah. Yeah. You see the, you can see the white bottom of it? He's kind of graping in the yellow. Yeah. Well, they both are having it, but... We have a question about the swim fins that you have on your feet, and how do they work? <laughs> yeah, so, uh... Are they talking to him? Yeah. It's a long, flat surface, and when it pushes all of the time, it provides a little extra force for me to swim, so... Uh, the hammerhead. There you go. Well, it's another question. Yes, right up here. You see that big hammerhead that was in the back there, D? Yeah. He's playing right by him. What's your question? Heard them? Uh -huh. They know they're in there, right? Yeah. Oh, yes, uh, we have a comment from one of our, one of our guests that it must be very hard to talk with something in your mouth like that. How many times a week do you guys dive? Well, there's uh, 14 different dive teams here in the National Park. Each dive team dives every other week. So my team is Saturday, and I get to dive all day today. And then I'll come back in two weeks and uh, dive again. But there are dive teams in the water every single day here. Wow. The animals, cleaning the exhibits, even the turtles. <laughs> The sea turtle. Photo bomb. Hey Jade, photo bomb. So what's going on over here? What's your question?
Oh, the hammerhead was in the background. He came up a few times. Yeah. I kind of like the, uh, the sea like turtle. The turtle yeah. yeah, he photobombed it. So what happened to Janita and them? You might be able to see the hammerhead better here. Well, we're coming out to where we weren't in. Now there's more. We got to go. There's stuff outside. There's the tunnel yet. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's way out here. It's just saying, it feels like it's nothing right here. What the hell is he? There's the hammerhead. What is that? It's a hell of a shark. It's always upside down. Yeah. Yeah, he's just chilling. Where? That has to be a baby. Yeah, that's a black tip. He's a baby. Uh, oh. <laughs> no, no, go ahead. <laughs> We're coming up to the jellyfish. These things are very dangerous. Really? Yeah. You get stung by them, you'll know it. What are these bags for? I don't know. Come on.
big old hippos. What? That's Ruby? Yeah, that's Ruby. <laughs> Ruby and Diamond right there. That's Ruby. Fat and lazy. Yep. <laughs> Man, when we were in Africa, we'd hear them motherfuckers every morning at five in the morning fighting. Them things are loud as shit. You think, you think Roxy's loud, them motherfuckers are loud. She's watching hippos. Really, she couldn't just come down here to three steps? Too much work? Maybe you should go swim with them. <laughs> no, they're coming. They're coming over to the people. That sounds really bad. You know, it makes me wonder. You know, it makes me wonder if the animals looking out the mirror said, look at all the idiot morons. Let me go, let me go swim over to them, pander to them. That's why I said, that's Ruby and that's Diamond up there. Yeah. And then that one place hiding the other one's butt and I was like, oh, you're really Mama. There's only two? Yeah. You can't have too many. Trust me, they fight. You see, hippos are very vicious animals. I did. See it at least. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a good one. I thought you were behind me at first. <laughs> 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 I know. What you see up there? He's all the way up on top or something.
<laughs> That's a free. It's not no megalodon. It's a prehistoric fish. I'm a huge shark fan. So they do give birth to live young. It's not quite a birth like mammals do. They do have eggs, so the yolk will feed the young. They'll hatch on the inside of their mother, and by the time they come out, they are live cubs. And what they'll do is swim inland just a little bit to a nice sheltered area like the Chesapeake or the Delaware Bay. Okay. It's done. She goes back out to the ocean, but the pups are in a little bit more of a sheltered area where there's plentiful food, and they can kind of hang out and be safe until they're a little bit bigger and they're ready to take on the food. So again, the way that we treat our local waterways is very much better to affect the sharks that we see right in front of us here in Shark Realm. So if there's any fishing lines, that's what they measured. It's not a real. Or balloons. When we release balloons, there's a sand tiger shark. It looks very cute, but they don't actually go to heaven. They all actually, in fact, end up. Those sand tigers look mean. A lot of them end up in sharks' bellies. Those are sand tigers. Around a shark, or they'll get caught up in really big commercial fishing nets. In other parts of the world, they will also be hunted for their fins. Give us the nanny, see if she wants to drink. So as with anything, we just want to be conscious with where we're getting our food. We want to be conscious of what we're using in our everyday life. We want to try to reduce our plastic use just to make sure that we're not harming these beautiful animals who are living in our ocean realm exhibit, or our shark realm exhibit, excuse me, right for us. If you've got any questions at all about our animals who live in this pool with us or about anybody else here at the aquarium today, feel free to ask. I'm going to hang out here for another couple of minutes. But otherwise, I hope you guys have a really phenomenal rest of your day here at the Look. aquarium. Imagine that swimming towards you. They don't go by sight. They go by sound and smell. They can smell a drop. They can smell a drop of blood up to almost six miles away. And the sand tigers are not built for speed. Like him, the reef shark, he's built for speed. But look, look at there. That's the best shot as he comes swimming up to you. Yeah. They yes, they do. And their teeth always are reproducing. When one falls out, another takes a spot and it grows another. Yeah, pretty much they do. Yeah. I would. Sign me up. I'd do it. Well, I think you, you guys might want to go back up and around because here's the entrance to the tunnel. <laughs> or we could just grab it and walk it. It's only a couple steps, all right. Yeah, well, we really didn't carry, we just held it. Hang on, guys. Wait for your mom and dad. Did you see the Megalodon, Joel? Come here. It's not official, but it's a replica of how big the Megalodon's mouth was. They have that shark here? No, that shark's extinct. 
Oh. But that's an exact replica of what a Megalodon's mouth would be like. That would, that would swallow Jade like a Tic Tac. Yep. And my people family. Fuck me, I'd be like a toothpick. Easy there, you. Here, hold this. I want to take the camera off the mount for this. Come on. Look at that. That's the tank you go in. Oh, that makes so me. A sandbar, the nurse. I'm reading the safety regulations. At all times, remain quiet in the water. So you can't pop, motherfucker. <laughs> Wait, No, it tells. It shows you where you actually go. You don't actually swim. There's a little section where you're laying like this, snorkeling, and they swim by you. Oh, so you don't actually go down? No, you're not actually in the tank you're tank. No. No. Oh, there's a good view. That's a drop. That'll hurt. As the shark comes up right behind, yeah. <laughs> hits his head in the glass. Bam. None of that shit. Uh, what's the shark bridge? You're almost there, little buddy. I believe you. It's like an adventure thing. Yeah, it's like an Really? Yeah. Come on, girl. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, you're walking over the shark tank. Yeah. Come on. Hang on, Jaden, come here. Go ahead in front of us. Excuse me. You guys can go ahead. We're going to get with her here. Come here. Yep. And I might just push you in. Oh, there, there's your dad. Let's go back. Yeah. Back to the line. Back to the line. No climbing. No more throwing the kids overboard. How sad. Uh, I know, right? Can, how does that work for insurance? I think that's how you guys are looking at it. That's how you get insurance. You got to first prove it was murder. The, the netting gave way. You fell. We tried grabbing you. Hey, 
is cool though, you get to see like a behind the scenes. Are you, what's wrong? You get scared? Bridge, everyone. Walking backwards does look cool, but we try not to do that here. Don't be scared. You could cut like one string and everyone just... Nah, it takes more than one string. You cut in the right spot. It's like a giant cargo net. This is cool though. Oh yeah, he's playing Jaws, he's walking with his fin out of the water. <laughs> we gotta get one of these for the pool. I don't know why Karina and Jade don't do this. Ain't nothing to it. No, it's just a. Hey, well, go with a stroller. <laughs> yeah. yeah. about the sharks, right? What? The sharks underneath. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's kind of wall though, like very. Yeah. It's actually Jade. It's actually safer than the Tom Sawyer Bridge. <laughs> oh hey, when did we get to Disney? Come off an attraction, go to a gift shop. I was thinking the same thing. You read my mind. <laughs> When did we get to Disney? <laughs> yeah, see that. How much is it? Eight. Those shirts you can make. Huh? I the little pirate snow globes. Are they nice? Yeah, they are nice. 30 bucks. That's not bad. Mm, not that nice. <laughs> Thanks, so. Yeah. Well, you figure it's a gift shop. Yeah, I know. <laughs> they have mugs for 12 bucks. He doesn't use mugs though. He Get uses, my shot glass. Yeah, that's it. He uses a plastic shot. Uh, Give him our refillable mug. <laughs> Here it's used, but you can have it. There's a penguin stone globe, huh? Right there. 30. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's expensive. Uh, oh, here's more snow globes.
30. Yeah.